Look, over time, the metagame of Melee has shifted drastically. If you've played Melee in the last five years, the first thing you'll notice about this tier list is that it's fucking garbage. New innovations are made with different characters, like Yoshi, Jigglypuff, Pikachu, and many more, and they were able to be used to a fuller potential. But what if I told you there were three characters that were so absolutely dog shit that no amount of new techniques, development, or AMSAs could save them? Three characters that Japanese people wouldn't play because they're so goddamn bad. In the last three official Melee tier lists since 2010, these characters have consistently ranked at the bottom of the bottom. Here are the characters you should main if you hate yourself. There's one very distinctive thing about Pichu which separates him from all the others. Pichu is the only one who kills himself. This fellow is the wrong man for the job. He's got a slew of problems, from forward air dealing almost as much damage to the opponent as you do to yourself, to the best juggle move, up air, doing 3%, to being the lightest character in the game and dying ridiculously early to anything. Here's a translated quote from Sakurai about Pichu as a character. In this smash, the honor of being the weakest is bestowed to Pichu. It has the physical weakness of shocking itself and taking damage when performing attacks that involve electricity. Its weight is the lightest among all characters too, and overall, its attacks are not powerful either. This motherfucker Sakurai thought, well goddamn I gotta make one character the worst, so he made this one. Melee Pichu is the only character who has ever been designed as a joke character. But here's the thing, he isn't actually the worst. He's worse than your average garbage off the street, sure, but we're not in the sewage zone just yet. Why? For one, Pichu has an air. This move is the move that you use a lot when you want to win. But really, Pichu has a losing matchup to Falcon. Pichu has a specific cheese, a chain grab, that can be used in this matchup. As proof of this, Codeman, the player who has wasted the most of his time playing Pichu, has taken a game off of SUJ, which you can see here in this very very grainy video. Good shit, Cody! Good shit, Cody! Let's fucking go, Cody! So overall, Pichu does have potential. You could argue that Pichu could even be as good as fifth worst in the whole game. Yuji King has also been quoted as saying that he thinks Pichu could be viable, but he's also been quoted as saying, oatmeal is better than cereal. So obviously, you can't trust anything this guy says. Regardless, who could possibly be worse than the character who was designed to be the worst in the game? In the most recent official tier list, Bowser is the second worst in the game. For my money, he is the worst. If Fox is Usain Bolt, Bowser is former president William H. Taft. If Sheik is Simone Biles, Bowser is the fat Mexican kid you knew in elementary school trying his hardest to do the sit and reach. He's by far the slowest, by far the clunkiest character in the game. Let's take a good look at Usain Bolt, not that one, real quick. Fox has a 3 frame jump squat, which makes him tied for the fastest in the game. Fox can do things out of jumps quicker, and this also applies to shine pressure, which is one of his best tools. Bowser has an 8 frame jump squat. Now you're thinking, well I just did the math. And that's only an extra of 1 12th of a second. That's not so bad, right? Wrong. Bowser can't do shit. If I'm Fox and you're Bowser, and we jump and try to do an aerial at the same time, you know what's gonna happen? Well, Bowser isn't gonna be the one who wins that interaction. And that's what happens with Bowser consistently. He's got some stuff like up the outer shield, some ledge gimmicks, but that's all he's rocking. He's the most painfully slow character in a lightning fast game. If you're thinking of notable wins, the last one was when DJ Nintendo beat Ryan Ford, ranked 15th at the time. Of course, that was in 2013. Eight years ago. Since then, Bowser hasn't seen much love. Since I was just on the topic of notable wins, the most notable Kirby win is when Moon Knight beat Crimson Blur. Crimson Blur, of course, being famously ranked top 100 among tournament organizers. I wanted to see if Kirby had anything good going for him, so I watched a tech guide on things that Kirby can do. He's got this, dash attack off of a platform into grab. I practiced for a bit, and I went into netplay to see if I could pull it off, and after 30 minutes of spamming it, here's what happened.
This character fucking sucks. Kirby can't grab. Kirby can't use moves. Kirby can't do shit. So look. Are Pichu, Kirby, and Bowser the three worst characters in the game? Maybe. Probably. Regardless of where they may be on someone's tier list, are they still dog shit? Yes. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. I'm intensely desperate, so also follow me on Twitter at VerbSSB.